Morning, darling. Daddy! <laughs> Mama said that when my tooth falls out, the tooth fairy will give me some money. What? Is that true? <laughs> really? Mama said that? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, it is true. I want to help you buy the house in Thailand. Oh, you want to help me? Do you hear that? I do hear that. I think that's a good deal. <laughs> Alright, let me take a look at it. Hello? Ooh. Hello? Hello? Oh, it's very unstable. But it's worth a few bucks. That was the fourth time this morning. What does your day look like? Uh, I have a class this morning, then meetings all day long. Okay, I'm taking Sophie to school in a bit. And then I'm going grocery shopping, and then Sophie has... Oh, yes, yes, ballet tonight. I'm guessing I'm the one picking her up, too. Please. <laughs> oh, don't give me that face. Please. Stop. Thank you. You're dirty, you're dirty. Just... Thank you. Honey, I need money for groceries. Are you gonna play Tooth Fairy tonight? I'll try. Make sure you have a good day, okay?
and remember who loves you. Be Mr. McQueen. Mrs. Hanson? Please call me Lizzie. reading the report, I say we dismantle the rest of these products. But we keep the parts of LS construction that can excel our growth and make us profitable. Microfiber chips. Sir? Sir? Uh, yeah, sorry. Um, run that that last part by me again, the uh, part about growth. If any of you would like some private classes, you know, please make yes. sure that you yeah. you put it in the form. Hot yeah. yoga as well. I wrote my number on you. Okay. Do you do also so more intense classes? It depends on the need of the person, you know. Okay. Whatever you need, you know, I can Thank provide. You so much. Thank you. I appreciate you. Mm -hmm. Thank, Thank you, very, you much. very much. Thank you, yeah? Okay, thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, my Instagram. Your Instagram is there? Yeah. Okay, beautiful. Mm -hmm. All right. Everybody put their email address, yeah? yeah. And the numbers. Mm -hmm. Okay, I appreciate you. Thank, thank you very you. much. Thank yeah. you so much. Yeah. Thank you again. We'll, we'll see. Thank you. Yeah. Okay, okay. Thank, thank you. you. Yes. Would you like some water? Yes, please. Pictures are beautiful. You have a good eye. Thank you. It's been a while since I picked the camera up. I haven't really been inspired. Did you do this one as well? I did. It's not my usual style, though. Interesting. Yeah. Uh, sir, do you have a Mr. Plaxton here to see you? Okay, send him in, Marsha.
Mr. Hanson, I, uh, I have another meeting in a minute, so can we keep this brief? Yes, sir. No problem. Mia Culpa Apartments, apartment 111, two days ago. Again, apartment 111, same two days every week. She block booked the place. She's had it for a couple of months now, paid cash. They uh, should be meeting tonight. All right. Well, as I said, I do have another meeting in a minute. So uh, thank you, Mr. Flaxon. We'll be in touch. Everything's on that pen drive. I also got the photos you requested of the other two women. See you. you too. You look wonderful. Thank you. No, not now. Later. Thank you. Bonjour, Bonjour Mr. McQueen. Ça va? Très bien, merci. Et toi? Qu'est-ce que je vous sers aujourd'hui? Euh, on va prendre le du vin, le Petrus 77. Excellent choix. How are you feeling? on top of the world, like I always am when I'm with you. You're gonna see me Tuesday, right? Like I just told you today, you have to give it three months. So you don't want to see me anymore? Listen, be in a positive place. This is the best you've ever been. But what if I regress? I'll remember to yourself. Beauty and age are only in the mind? Correct. Why don't we start with the painting? The painting? The painting is just a painting. You know, every beautiful thing has some kind of hidden pain. What's yours? Well, there's none. It's just a painting. Is it how you see yourself? Hidden in plain sight? You see those pictures of Esther? Yeah. Well, I know where he'll be tonight. You still down? Family should stick together. Fine, count me in. You sure? Yeah. Good. And we're on for tonight. Good afternoon on this construction. It's me. Did you get it? Yeah. Uh, give me a minute. You satisfied?
665 grand. That's right, sir. $665,000. Thank you. Uh, and she, she withdrew that this afternoon? Yes, Mr. Hansen, in cash. Uh -huh. All right, well, thanks for keeping me informed. I appreciate it. Is there anything else I can help you with? No, no, that's it for now. Thank you. Thank you for banking with First American Bank, Mr. Hansen. And make sure you have a very good day. My doctor thinks the reason I can't conceive is psychological. Your mind has to arrive at its destination before your body does. My husband wants a child now. And you? What do you want? A child with someone I can connect with. Yeah, I had to head back and get a few things. You had a little bath? I had a class at the gym. Okay, enjoy. You okay? Yeah. You know, I never realized before how clearly you can see things from here.
I go out tonight, huh? Go do something, I'll go dancing at the Grand. Come back here afterwards and... Maybe we can try again. Most fertile the next few days, right? It's girls' night tonight. Maybe we can do that tomorrow night and then come back here and try again. Sure. I left a plate of food in the fridge for you. I'll probably just go have something on the way home. I gotta go. Missy Hansen. I love you, Richie Hansen. Hey, hey, my queens. Hey, babe. Sophie just got hey. into bed and she wants to tell you good night. Right. Daddy, my tooth just fell out. I wasn't I wasn't very proud. Yes, she was. <laughs> That's my girl. When is the tooth fairy gonna come with my money? When you go to bed. <laughs> you have to fall asleep first, okay? So now go to bed. Good night. Love you. Good night. I love you too. Mm hmm. So, how's the schedule looking? I'm down to my last client now. So, I might come home early, in three or four hours. I'll see you then.
stay in the moment. What do you want from me? Where's the bag? I'll get it. Here I go. What do you want from me? Hmm? Oh, yeah. No, no, no. Who are you? Who are you? No, 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 no. Why are you doing this? piece of shit doesn't deserve to be punched. You little fuck! How are you feeling now, asshole? Huh? I, uh... I, uh... want to see his... dick. What? Mm. Yeah. See his dick. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, you know what? Here. Take a look at mine. <laughs> oh! Ah. All right, that's 
to know. I want your pin number. I'm gonna remove the tape, and you're gonna tell me your pin number. You understand? My patients are running thin with you. What's that fucking pin? Take it easy. You gonna behave? Tell me your pin number. Is the pin number. What do you want from me? This is a felony. You know that. Let me go. I want press charges. What is the fucking pin number? Sixty nine. Eleven, You waiting for someone? You sleeping with my wife? No, I'm not. He's figured out who I am. And now I want the truth. Are you fucking my wife? Grab his head. What? Grab his head! What? first. Are you fucking my wife? He thinks we're assholes. I say we fuck him up. What are we waiting for? Are you sleeping with my wife? No. I'm a therapist. I feel we have danced like this a thousand lifetimes before. Fucking liar. I am not gonna have this smug little prick play fucking mind games with me. I'm a therapist. I'm treating her. For what? 
We are bound by patient client confidentiality. Well, right now you're bound by duct tape, asshole. I treat people who have problems, mental problems, physical problems, spiritual problems. You know all about your fucking little immigrant hustle. You're an escort. I say we fuck them up. No, I am a therapist. In a rented apartment, in the middle of the fucking night. In your car? He's all fucking class, this guy. I can't explain. I treat them. I treat all your wives. Lizzie Anson. Esther Jarrett. Susie Ellis, check in my pants and see my ID. I'm legally licensed. Holy shit, he's not lying. So you're a licensed therapist who fucks his clients? No, I help them with their problems. Are you listening to this? Where do you get your fucking balls big enough for you see the clothes this guy has on? Look at the shirt he's wearing. How much of my money paid for that shirt? How much? All right, calm down. How much do they pay for your treatments? Depends on their problems. Each, each case is different. How much did my wife pay? Per hour. Admitted. You fucked my little Susie, didn't you? Satisfaction guaranteed or your money back. How much did she pay you? $275 an hour. What? $275 per hour? Does she owe you money? No, she doesn't. Do you know how much fucking money? Do you know how much money I make? How long have you slept with Susie? Like I say, I treat her. How long? Answer him. About five months. And Lizzie? Maybe six. How, 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 how did it all start? Through referrals. Referrals? referrals? What? Yeah, I'm a therapist. I have a business. I have a list of private clients. I'm very selective. So who referred Susie? I said, I cannot tell you. So it's just a, it's just a business. You pay taxes, you provide insurance. I'm not out to hurt anyone. I'm just there to save them. Save them? Yes, save them from themselves. You just manipulate women, don't you? I'm not the bad guy here. So who is? You tell me, Evan. Don't you get smart with me. And then, then why did she pay you? You don't want to know. Why? Answer him! Fucking answer, answer him! Why do you think she comes to see me? Why do you think all your wives come to see me? You better be careful. I want to know why Lizzie lied about bridge night on Tuesday and girls' night out on Thursday. I'm gonna find out. And if I don't get a satisfactory answer, we are gonna fuck this bastard up. <laughs> Listen, they trust me, and I'm just there for them. They want to talk, and I listen to understand them, to help them, to help them become wives again, to help them become better women. How dare you sit there and talk about my woman like that? 
You don't know her, my woman. You see, <clears throat> that's the problem. She's someone's daughter, your sister. My wife, she's not a thing. She's not a piece of meat. There are a few things she deserves. She wants to be respected. She wants to be loved. So you make him feel loved? Make him feel wanted? You see, we connect. We talk. We sit, we watch TV. Sometimes I read to them and they fall asleep. I give them what they're missing. It's not about sex. What are you talking about? Fucking respect. Making them feel special. I'm not here to break your marriages. I'm actually helping them. I should cut your cock off. And we'd see how you'd be there to help them. I'm happy to marry myself. You married? You're a fucking liar. Look at uh, my phone. I have pictures. 69, 11, 69. I even have a beautiful daughter. You're all a drain on society. So, how does your wife feel about what you do? She understands that I'm helping people. It's not personal. Oh, <laughs> hold on. Let me get this straight. You fuck my wife, and I pay you, and it's not personal? I'm simply feeding my family. Oh. You know, I feed her. Yeah. She's not bad. Actually, you know what? I'd fuck her. <laughs> hmm. How would you like that? How would you like if I'd fuck your wife, huh? I'd give her the right of her life. <laughs> Susie was right about you. What did you say? I said that Susie was right about you. Why do you think she comes to see me? Because you sleep with her? No, wrong answer. Why? Because I work hard and I work late. No. Then why? Because you are in denial. You're losing your business. Close to bankruptcy. Shut up. You can't repay your creditors. You're one of his creditors, right? I said shut up. Unless you know about this. You know what? You have no backbone. You are godless. You yella. I said, shut the fuck up. <sighs> Fucking my wife. Giving her the right of her life. How are you gonna do that? You can't even get it up. You are impotent. <laughs> She called you Viagra. Get it? Can't get it up? Thing is, your wife needs sex. She's not had sex for years. Sunshine, tell me about my money. Go get that hammer. You can see, let me go. I'm not going to say anything to the police. No one needs to know. Tell me what you and Lizzie were planning to do with my money. I said, go get that hammer. You tell me about the money, I can make this stop. It's up to you. No, no, no. 
What are you doing? I'm gonna enjoy this more than you enjoyed fucking my wife. Where's that hammer? Get it in here. To the hands. No, 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 this. Get it into the hands. No. No, 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 no. No, no, don't do this. No, don't do it. Don't do it. You are not like him. Get it into the hands. You're bitter than him. Shut up, you pussy. You know it. Don't. Don't. No, don't do it. No. 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 Hey, hey, right? I'm sorry, I just, I couldn't. It's all right, it's all right, don't worry about it. We just gotta get back inside, let's go. No, I can't do this. I'm sorry. No, listen, we, we all agreed. We agreed we were gonna strip him, beat him, throw him in the grave to scare the shit out of him. You know, and then send him home with a final warning, but not this. I know, I know. There's a way out of hand. I know, Jared's out of control. I know. You know that I know. I don't like you. Sorry about the business. I was gonna tell you. I just didn't know how. I don't give a shit about the business. No, no, no. I was trying to fix it, but I just it got worse. I'm fucked. I, I fucked up. I understand. It's Fuck. okay. I swear to you, you're gonna get paid. Everyone's gonna get paid. I'm gonna, it's I'm okay. gonna pay you back. Listen, everybody's gonna get paid. I've back. already taken care of it. Do you understand? Business. Lizzie's gonna be here any second. Come on, let's go. No, I'm not going back. Okay, then get out of here. All right, go. This night, he said he was ready not to report it. We can all walk away from this. I'm gonna handle it, okay? I'm gonna fucking handle it like I handle everything. Now get out of here. I'm telling you, you're not taking my business. Over the fence. Same way you came in. You're not tanking my business. So let him see you. Don't you dare. Don't. Oh, no. Yeah. No. Humiliate him, scare him a little bit, and then cut him loose. Where's Ellis? He's gone. That fucking coward. What is it with you and these questions? He's got answers. I want them. Lizzie's gonna be here at 11.30. That's right. Yeah. I feel sorry for her. What the fuck are you mumbling about, huh? I feel sorry for Esther. She used to pay me just to cry over you. That psychoanalysis bullshit don't work with me. Why, you don't want to hear about the truth? About our secrets? Jimmy Jarrett. You think the entire world owes you? That's not true. Nobody gives a fuck. And that's killing you. That's why you drink. You're fucking drunk. Okay, okay, okay. Thank you, thank you. Come on, for Christ's sakes. Where's my dinner? I asked for it like 10 minutes ago. Tell me it's coming. 
Yeah, well, come on. Please. I just whipped them. Clean that up! You bring salad to the table that's got no dressing on it? Clean it up! No, I feel bad for her. I feel bad for your sister. Because she loves him. What the fuck have you been doing all day? Huh? What the fuck have you been doing all day? Get me another beer! Now! She loves you. And that's killing her. And the truth is, without her, you... You fucking moron. And you know it. You just keep talking shit, boy. I'm gonna knock that fucking smile off your face. Oh, yeah? What about the headaches? Yeah. Let's talk about the headaches. Why do you think she goes at the hospital every week? Huh? Why do you think? What causes the imbalance? What the fuck is he talking about? How, how can you do that to a woman? Uh, your sister? What, what do you oh, do? About shut that? your lying filth! Why would you do that? Why would you do that? Stop! You're gonna kill him! She's been beating your sister. No, I'm sorry! No, I'm sorry! This is a Lying, marinate yourself in vodka, and you beat my sister. Fuck you, Richie. What have you ever done for me? Are you fucking kidding me? I've been carrying you for years. Oh, you employ me, so now you own me. All she does is take care of you, and you beat her. You abuse her like a punk. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> She wanted you to be the last one to know. She wanted you to feel guilty. To feel pain. The way she's felt for years. Every single day. Yeah. Dead. Dead but not smiling. then she'll be free. Esther's died. Touch my sister again, and I'll kill you. You understand me? But you're gonna take his word over mine. You want me to look? You said family should stick together. You're not my family. 
You don't work for me. You're fired. This is over. Get the fuck out of here. You know what, Richie? Fuck you. I'm sorry. We never should have done this to you. And it's my fault. So, uh, how about I just cut you loose and we forget this whole thing ever happened? Finger is not broken. I'll take you to the hospital. I'll pay for it. Here. It's okay. I wouldn't blame you if you wanted to press charges. charges against who? You guys or your wife, Lizzie? My wife? Yeah. She scares me. She scares you? When my other clients understand that I have a family, a wife and a beautiful daughter. But Lizzie, she will not leave me alone. <laughs> that scares me. You're sleeping with my wife and my wife scares you. I have not slept with your wife. Don't bullshit me. I have never slept with your wife. Oh, that is just a big misunderstanding. Your wife should not leave me alone. She calls me all the time. <laughs> calling me, calling my cell, my house. She even called me sometimes when she's in bed with you. I've known my wife for five years. I've been married for four. You do not know your wife. Believe me. The other day she sent me a video of my wife shopping with my kid. How does she know my wife? Huh? Maybe you're telling the truth, and maybe you're not. And maybe you deserve this. Maybe this is karma. Do you know your wife has a gun? A gun? Yeah. She says she will kill me. She will kill my family. And then she'll kill herself. But this is bullshit. You're telling me I don't know my wife? I don't think you do know your wife. You have to understand that. She's not who, who you think she is. 
Your wife is... is... For me, she's crazy. Please check yourself. Lizzie. Lizzie doesn't love me anymore. All I ever wanted was to have a child with her. I think you need to hear her for yourself. You need to understand what's going on. Why don't you go to the closet, wait for her to come. Understand. <laughs> That's her majesty. That's her. On speaker. Well, here, waiting for you. Okay. How long before you get here? Five to ten minutes. Okay, five to ten minutes. I'll be here. I'll be there soon. So shocking. Okay. And also, I know about the money. There's something she's she's going to do regarding your, your business. What? What is she planning? It's, it's not very clear, but I'm sure I can find out. How do I know this isn't a setup? Was attacked by a bunch of drunk guys. My sweetheart, you okay? Are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. I'm never gonna let anybody hurt you, sweetheart. I know. <coughs> Are you okay? Yeah. Can we get me some water, please? I'm sorry, I'm sorry.
Oh. In all my dreams. I never imagined that this day would come. We knew it. Right here. Right now. Just like this. You fixed me. You made me strong. You put me back together again. Oh, you saved me. You saved me. You fixed my heart. You know it. You know it. Yeah. So I try. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> Look at this. I got it. It's everything. It's everything that we need for the house in Thailand to get set up. Everything we need for our new life together. It's just you and me. <laughs> I just can't do this anymore. Listen. What? I'm never gonna leave my family. This is a beautiful dream, but let's get back to reality. I'm sorry, I don't understand what you're saying. That story of soulmates and all that crap. <laughs> I think your imagination just went wild. What about your wrist? Lizzie, it's just doing my job. I don't understand. So you don't wanna you don't wanna be with me? You said that you loved me. You said that you wanted to be with me forever. It's just doing my job. All right? I was doing my job. Don't do that again. What the fuck are you talking about? Go away! You're scaring me. What the fuck is your problem? You are scaring me. What about soulmates? What about our parents? What about our parents? You said, you said that our parents both died the same way. You said that. Is that true? Is that true? Is that true? No. You said we were soulmates! What have you done to my life? You said that we were fucking soulmates. What is your problem? What is your problem? Stop, stop. What is your stop, problem? Do what is stop. your problem? Listen, no. You said that we were together. You said that we were together forever and you wanted to be with me forever no matter what. What about your husband? What do you mean, what about my husband? Don't you love him? What are you talking about? We've talked about this a thousand times. You know what that was about. What are we about? You cannot break his No! Head. He needs you. You love me. What are you fucking doing? I don't understand. It's not about me. No, it's not. It's about me now. And I don't need you. I don't need you. I don't need you anymore. I don't need you. Chris. I have got everything that crazy, I need. You're crazy. No! Stop it, stop it. You stop it. Stop it. You're the one that's fucking crazy. You're just a crazy. fucking hustler. Oh, it's not about the sex. It's not about the sex. Oh, we're just playing. It's not about the sex. You're just playing.
thing. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, I'm just here to help you, baby. I just want to make everyone so fucking happy, baby. You're just a bullshitter. You're a fucking bullshitter. Look at me. You think I'm a fucking fool? Do you think I'm a fucking idiot? Clearly, you have mistook my kindness for weakness, but I see right through you. You told me that you wanted to have my baby. You told me to get rid of his baby. I did that. I got rid of his baby for you, so I could have your baby. I'm having your baby. What are you talking about? the lifetime this year, and son. Maybe things will be different. I can't stop thinking about you. I know you feel the same. Come on, admit it. I can't leave my husband. We are soulmates, Lizzie. Oh, what about Richie? Richie. He doesn't understand. Doesn't connect with you. No, I stop you. it. Just stop it. We can be and be together, Lizzie. The child was someone I can connect with. You're right. I love you. We're soulmates. We need the gun for security, for our security. How did you find me? Are you just telling me what you want? Don't do, do, it. do it. I feel we have danced like this a thousand lifetimes before. That's it. Stop it. That's it. Oh God, I love you. Oh, stop. Darling, he's two thirds on his way to his daughter in a tooth. Rough day. Yeah. Kind of. Did she bring the money? Yeah, she brought the money. Well, on the need of the person, you know, oh, whatever you, you need, you know, I can thank provide. Thank you so much. Thank you. I appreciate you. Mm. Voilà le résultat d'aujourd'hui. Maman, il y a beaucoup. I think this one's really good. Yeah, it could work. Look at that. Married 24 years, he travels. 
She spends her days at the club. Perfect client. Perfect client. But it's a long story I have to explain later. I have to let her go, though. Don't worry. I have other potential lined up. Good. How much, uh, how much longer? You know, about half an hour. I love you.